you are. Oh, it's Princess. Here, Here, princess. Oh, Wolf, I remember you talking about that before. How you had broken your ankles. And horned. Should have known it would be stubborn. Can I pick it up? Come on. Alright, use the bell. the bell. Okay. Come on, buddy. This way, your grace. Should have guessed as much. What's a witcher compared to a patch of wild strawberries? Do I really have to keep ringing this bell for you to follow? Come on. Yes. David. You do. You do. I wasn't snowboarding, I was skiing, and my sister fell on me. That's even worse. <laughs> oh, man. Well, at least you guys had that story. You have that story to tell for the rest of your lives. Where is the damn goat going? You stupid fucking goat. I'm ringing the bell. Bear. Bear. A bear? God damn it. Oh, he called it a stupid piece of shit. Nice. Well, the bear wasn't too bad. Woo! What the hell hit me? Alright, you stupid fucking goat. She tripped. <laughs> well, like I said, you'll have that story. Come on, you damn goat. Friends in time. You've got that all important quality every roach has to have. You don't talk much. Princess. Come on, Princess. Now go get shagged by your owner because he's apparently a goat fucker. <laughs> My baby! Goat She's returned! My dearest, sweetest goat! All right, don't get too affectionate. I'm standing right here. All right, will you help me now? You better help me now. You, but I'm kind of in a hurry. Anna and Tamara, they might be in danger. The white wolf helped the Pella, and so the Pella shall help him. Blood. We need Good to know. A living being. <laughs> Fine. Be right back. What? I totally wasn't paying attention to the conversation. Yeah, I fell at her and broke her ankle. <laughs> there you go. There you go. Ugh. Will this do? Oh, I guess I can kill this light. The sun's come up now. Yeah, you never know what would happen. Maybe she just put a face planted in the snow. Had some bruises or whatever. Maybe not. Who knows? Yeah, but I think you definitely got... Yeah. Just about as bad as you could uh, be hoping for there. Uh-oh. Holy shit. Blood. I see blood. Who's? No one. No tomorrow. Just the child. Well then. A child that lives not, yet did not die. Huh. Interesting. I wonder if that's uh it's our friend back at the castle. It? That is it. Spirits had nothing more to say, like where they went or where they are now. You came for an augury, an augur I did. They're gone. The child remains. Interesting. Mentioned a child. Whose? 
Why, Anna's. Anna was pregnant? She was. And she miscarried. Hmm. Baron didn't mention it. Afraid, perhaps. Or ashamed, or forgetful. Or perhaps he had no wish to remember. Probably no wish to remember. I don't think that's something people normally want to remember. Um, did the Baron have anything to do all this? Or you know all this how? Well, we know how he did it. He just did his little arguing spell thing, Mabob. Not Anna. It was the omens told me. Great. So I can be sure it's true. The omens need not your faith to be true. It is you who needs the omens to lead you to truth. Did the Baron have anything to do with this? That fat bastard. His wife's miscarriage. Foul tempered he is, and he's a fondness for hooch. No doubt makes his temper even fouler. Did he abuse his family? Anna came to you. You must have noticed something. The Pella's old, near blind. But Princess came and licked her hand. So what? She's a wise beast. Only comes to those who suffer. So what's this game about? Well, it's an open world game that honestly has hundreds of quests in it. Um, it's a very long game. You can literally spend hundreds of hours playing this game if you want to do every little single side quest. Uh, but basically you play as the Witcher, who is basically a man who's mutated with special abilities. And uh, right now you're looking for a Siri, which is this girl that used to uh, train. She's being hunted by something called the Wild Hunt, and you're looking for her to basically protect her and do whatever. And you're also been hired by um, this other man, not the Baron, not the quest we're doing right now, but this this other guy, like a king or something that's hired you to search for his daughter. So you're searching for people right now. Well, I don't know if it's hundreds of quests, but there's, there's, yeah, it's probably hundreds of quests. Yeah, there's hundreds of quests probably in this game. Um, it's, it's a very, it's a large open world game. Um, and you can either choose to do like the main quest to the child in a or, um, without right or do all side quests and just take now your time. You could probably do the, all the main quests in probably like 30 hours or so. Botchling. White wolf, wise wolf, catch the botchling. The botchling will help lead the wolf to the loved ones. Botchling suck the blood of... I'm guessing you could probably do all of the side quests. Help. Tis a being and probably like a hundred and something hours. I think it takes like a hundred percent. I mean, a hundred percent. I think it takes like a hundred plus hours to hundred percent this game. I'm not sure. Blood will always find kindred blood. Um, how can I lift the curse? Heard of one witcher who lifted a botchling's curse. Never tried it myself, though. I know you need to bury it under the threshold. And give it a name. Perform the I'm Roin. The ritual of naming. That's an elven custom. Human, elven, dwarven, ancient. Spirits have no race. They honor not its meaning. Win a spirit's favor, and the spirit shall aid you. Ask, and it will answer. Seek, and it will show you the way. Why do you need its blood? Why do you want its blood? Blood, blood, blood. Yeah, we're not going to 100% this game because we're not going to do all the playing cards. Even if we do all the quests, I'm probably not going to do all the playing cards. Maybe I will. We'll see. We'll see what happens. All right, Kat, thanks very much for stopping by. Have yourself a wonderful, what does it say, Monday? Have a good Monday. Stop by any time, and I'll talk to you later. Hope you feel better. Go take some painkillers or whatever they gave you. <laughs> Reconcile the dead with the living. There shall be no forefathers eve this year. But we'll find a way all the same. Screw Monday. <laughs> Screw broken ankles. I hear you right. You mentioned forefathers eve. Pretty old custom. Thought it had died out. Death lurks in every bog and puddle round here. Folk know they could die. Their earthly matters unresolved. Then they require help, or they'll not know peace. Forefathers' Eve must be performed. Light the tallow candles to lead them through the dark. Call them by name. Appease their regrets. Only then may they depart in peace. Uh, I need to know where the botchling is. Yeah, in Whatever order to do all any of that stuff. Find the botchling first. Seek it at midnight, near the grave that lies empty. If what you say is true, the Baron ought to know where that grave is. 
All right, so gotta go talk to the Baron. So let's do a couple of things here. We gotta read the bestiary. Also, let's go through all this stuff. Aha! See, Dandino, you're right. Bestiary added from that book. Another one. Sweet. Some of these we've already read. I'm just going to read everything just to make sure we don't miss anything. I think that's all the books. That is all the books. We got two more bestiary uh, things out of it though, so that's awesome. Now we need to learn more about botchlings. There we go. They're vulnerable to the oxy sign. That's good. Cursed oil. I don't think I have any cursed oil. Uh, botchlings are perhaps the most repulsive creatures a witcher will ever have the displeasure of meeting. Ooh. Born of dead, unwanted babies, discarded without a proper burial. Uh, that explains the miscarriage. These creatures, these hideous creatures feed on the blood of pregnant women. Nice. A botchling stands around a foot and a half in height, but when threatened and engorged with blood, it can change form. Oh, sweet. It grows into a deformed man, hunched over and striding ape-like on its forearms. Nice. A botchlin curse can be lifted by transforming it into a lubberkin, a guardian spirit of the hearth that watches over a family. Oh, so you can turn it into something good. That's good. All right, let's go talk to our Baron fellow here. Need to save as well. Hit it, Roach. Let's go. And I'm out of stamina. Damn it, horse. Come on. Slower. Let's go. No, no, not slower. Faster. Ah, fucking. Fucking bridges. Shit like that. It does not like. The horse does not like them at all. Oh, man. What's going on here? The castle's on fire. What the fuck? What the bloody hell. Oops. Why is the castle on fire? What the hell? Terrible. Damn it, here's our billboard. Hold up. And there we go. Damn. I think somebody's trying to hide some evidence Oswin. here. What do you think? Where's Oswin? Anyone seen him? Who the hell is Oswin? To the stable. What? Fire. You blind? Nobody willing to put it out? Ain't that simple. Most are afraid. Baron flies into a rage. He takes no prisoners. My brother's in the stable. We've got to save him. He'll burn alive. Him and the horses. All right. I'll try. See what I can do. Hurry now, quick! Where's the stable at? Save the stable hand and the horse is trapped in.